everyone so welcome back to my channel and today I'm actually building a house and I'm doing a speed build of this house and um, the very first part I actually rendered it separately than the, than the second part so this video will be rendered like twice so if you see like the first part it seems like a little bit faster that's probably why but yeah so um, I'm building this house and it's actually a very very modern house and I love modern houses a lot I also love metal Mediterranean houses but I don't really know how to build a Mediterranean house so I just decided you know I'll just build a modern house no big deal but um yeah so I got some inspiration from a house online which you'll see the picture very soon okay there it is yeah there it is um I got inspiration from that house because I just looked online I was like you know what I really want to build a house today I haven't done a speed build in over a month I think um, I think it was Thanksgiving which I did it and now it's like the anniversary or the month or the month anniversary I don't know but um yeah th I thought it was time so I decided to do this today and um I like I really like how this house turned out um I definitely think that I'm improving on doing speed builds because when I first started out I started out a little bit rough but um, as time progressed, I think I'm getting a little bit better and I'm really enjoying doing these speed builds. And, um, and um, oh yeah, on the thumbnail, there's actually a car. Um, it's a red car. Um, I downloaded it from The Sims Resource. I think the person's name is The Numbers Woman. And you can go ahead and download that car as well if you want to. If you find this house on the gallery, it will not have that car on it I'm gonna replace it with another car because with the recent update that the Sims people the Sims people have made um, it's very difficult to find um, houses households lots whatever um, with custom content on it so I have decided to just remove that and if you want to download that separately definitely do that so you have an option if you want to but yeah I thought it added a nice touch because I just did so yeah so back to the house um I kind of built like this pretend garage because you know there's a lot of things we don't have in the sims 4 that we had in the sims 3 so I kind of pretend like with the car with the garage and stuff and the roof I love playing with the roof I thought it turned out really well actually um, I usually struggle with the roofs because I feel like they look weird but I thought this one actually turned out really well I also played with the move objects on thing but it got really annoying especially with the windows and stuff um, it just got really super annoying because the windows, they, they just turn into a wall when you use move, move objects on. So you don't really need to use it for windows and stuff. But yeah, I really like how the house turned out, just like I said. And if you want to download this, definitely do that. I will link everything below. You can, you can now link stuff, which is really cool. And yeah, that's pretty much all I need to say for this video. And, um, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And one last thing, very important actually, um, I'm... I didn't actually furnish the inside of the house because um, I'm actually going to enter this house into Magical Unicorns collab series thing and um, I would love if she furnished it so if she ends up doing that that would be great um, but yeah I'm going to send this house on to her and um, if she ends up furnishing it I will link it down below and that would be great if she does but yeah so um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video just like I said don't forget to give this a big thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comments because I love like seeing comments they just brighten my day and everything so yeah um i will see you guys in the next video